The popular monarch Oni of Ife says that there isn't any other queen replacing Olori Queen Naomi, that his enemy is at work to ruin his marriage. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time of coming across this channel, you are highly welcome. Please kindly subscribe and turn on your notification bell for more interesting news. And for my returning subscribers, thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys. So that is our tea date. Um, the cost of Oni and the Queen Naomi issue is still unknown to every one of us. Even though Queen Naomi somehow has revealed a little bit of it. Um, but it's no longer a news, guys, that Queen Naomi and Oni are trying to settle their differences. Yes, you know, for, for some time now, there has been this uh, ongoing secret uh, reconciliation. Um, by the Elife um, Odua elders and um, some prominent people, you know, they have been um, trying to like resolve the whole of all this because it has lingered for long. So it's it has been on news that um, they are trying to settle their differences and all that. So guys, well, that is not the reason why I'm making this video. Guys, uh, I have brought the good news concerning what Oni um, says about Queen Naomi. This is unbelievable, guys. You know, we all know that um, Onirisa has avoided the media, you know, in issue of Queen Naomi. Like he avoided anything that concerns him speaking publicly about, about her all this while. But finally, guys, Oni has openly debunked the news of uh, wedding a new Olori. Guys, this is unbelievable. Though. He further says that there isn't any other... Um, Olori replacing Queen Naomi, that his enemy is at work to ruin his marriage, and that he is trying everything he can to make sure that um, him uh, and Queen Naomi, they are back again together, and Queen Naomi will soon return back to the palace. So guys, uh, I got this from a source, but I'm a kind of doubting how true it is, because uh, the whole thing is like happening so fast. I was like, how is this possible? Uh, we, have been, we have been talking about reconciliation, reconciliation, but the, something has not been, you know, um, been said publicly. Or is it because uh, they are trying to keep the whole thing secret within them? Like they don't want to publicize anything concerning the palace, concerning Queen Naomi again and all that. Guys, I am, you know, even doubting it. But guys, from the source, um, it is being said that Oni wants to, you know, surprise everyone. Because, you know, Oni has been mocked, you know, seriously. They have mocked him concerning the issue of his marriage, marrying and divorcing, bringing another new wife and all that. That he doesn't want any of all those things again. That Queen Naomi will come back. That whatever it is, they, they, they're going to resolve their differences and Queen Naomi will certainly be back to the palace. So guys, uh, before I continue, um, there's something I want to talk about. You know, some people who has been, you know, writing, even in my comment section, some people have been saying all manner of things that Queen Naomi has embarrassed Oni so much by writing what uh, she wrote on the Instagram and all that. But guys, looking at it, for me, I don't think uh, Queen Naomi uh, had said anything negatively about Oni. Or I don't think, uh, you know, she came out there to... You know, insult Oni in any way. As in, uh, I look at her as someone who is even very bold enough to express her genuine feeling about her experience in the palace. And it is good for her own emotional and psychological well-being self, guys. So it is not, I don't see it as any insult in any way. I don't know how other people look at it. When you talk about Queen Naomi and uh, whatever she is doing, people will always come to write all manner of things in your comment section saying Queen Naomi and sorted Oni by, by stating that she is no longer um, queen. She's no longer interested in the queenship uh, of a thing again. But me, I don't see it as an insult, guys. I have not seen anywhere. This woman we are talking about is someone who has, um, you know, who has always shown Oni the highest and the, you know, quality of respect. Even honor Oni so much throughout her stay in the palace. But even in all that, she wasn't even regarded. And that was why she quietly left 
the palace and people are you know saying that she walked away from the palace she walked away from oni who is she to walk away from oni so guys um queen naomi never uh, uh for me for, in my own opinion here i don't see it as a disrespect she only you know, move away for her sanity sake she only move away because it's already affecting her emotionally and psychologically her whatever reason of living is already affecting her for her to even come out to say or write all those she wrote in the instagram there that means she has something that is troubling her already you understand so i don't see it as any disrespect so i'm just trying to clear this for people coming to write a long note for me in the comment section guys let me be honest with you people why this woman eh, left is because they have so much look down on her like she doesn't even like she's losing her respect and everything that she has already and that is why she just shifted i just look at it as if um, you know they are separated but not divorced that is the way i'm looking at it they are separated from each other not divorced because divorce has to do with two persons divorce is usually two persons that is involved and secondly, Oni has not even said anything concerning uh, him divorcing Queen Naomi. Okay, that uh, okay, they are now divorced. He has not come out to say anything concerning it. But we now the haters, people who are who wish them bad, all of us, you know, coming out to say that uh, Oni has moved on, Queen Naomi has moved on. They are separated, and when two people are separated, what do you expect from them? So, guys, uh, this is um. The news concerning what um, Oni has, uh, you know, openly said that Queen Naomi still remains Olori and Queen Naomi will still be back to the palace very soon. This information is from a reliable source, guys. So for those coming to ask me, how did you get to know? How true is that and all that? I will not come here to tell you people something that I didn't get the real gist. So guys, um... Oni and Queen Naomi, guys, they will be back together again. You know now, women now, she will want to do small shakara. Queen Naomi, of course, she's pretty, she's, you know, very fine young lady. So she will do small shakara for Oni, so that Oni self go, you know, uh, try, you know, amend things too. So that whenever she comes back to the palace, she will be, you know, valued, she will be respected. See, the way Queen Naomi is being loved by everyone. Her haters are just few. Those ones are just irrelevant. People who don't just like her. They are just how many number of them. People who love her more than people who don't like her. And guys, I think this will bring me to the end of this, uh, my video. Just write down whatever you feel concerning this. But guys, Oni and Queen Naomi, they are coming back. Like, seriously, they are... Any moment from now, you guys will hear the news. So guys, thank you so much for watching. And please... Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share my video. Thank you so, so much for watching. Bye-bye.